In the beginning, God created the heavens and He created the earth. He created every living thing upon the earth. Thousands of years later, along comes myself, Ed Waters, and I created Free Circle so I could bring you the fireside. We want to bring you truth with integrity, insight that's right, and stories that matter the most today. So climb on in, buckle up, let's take a ride on the fireside. Today I want to talk about educating yourself, coming out of that ignorance, that unknowing stage, providing sustenance to your brain, your cognitive ability, making sure you know what you're doing, common sense. Educating yourself comes in many forms. The form that we normally find is schools. However, education starts long before school starts in your life. Education starts the moment you're born. You're subjected to these feelings, these sounds, these sights, these tastes. It's all unfamiliar. So you have to learn about them. Education is a natural thing. Yet we fear it. I know a lot of us fear education. I was one of the biggest on this. I do not like to read and I thought reading was education. How wrong I was. Everything in your life educates you, my friends. Reading? Yes, I highly recommend reading. Reading is enjoyable if you're reading a subject that entices your brain. So that's the point. You can educate yourself with the things you like. If you're not well at reading, well, pick up a book about something you enjoy, something that you're really interested in. And it will take a little bit. But if you do it, it gets easier and easier. Don't worry about what people think. You don't have to read out loud. Just read to yourself. There's tools to help you if you do not understand words. Use a dictionary. Obviously, you've got a computer because you're listening to me right now. So Google those words. That's the important thing, taking the initiative and the time to understand what you're reading. If you don't understand what you're reading, you're not truly educating yourself. So take the time. That's all you've got is time. Take the time to look those words up. Study those words. Identify the structure of the word and what it really means. Once you start doing this on a daily basis, it becomes fun, exciting, and you look forward to the next thing you can read about. I like to listen to people. I find myself on podcasts or TED Talks. And I listen to people a lot. 
Because listening is educating yourself. You're understanding. So don't be afraid of education. Education is a good thing. And educating yourself on the things that you want to do, it's actually a good thing, people. If you need help, reach out. There's people that can help you. Don't be afraid. Don't be ashamed. Because the shame is not being able to do it. The glory is reaching out and saying, I want to know how to do it. Don't worry about what people say or think. If you are trying to change yourself, it doesn't matter how long it takes. And that's generally the thing that a lot of people think. Well, I I just don't have the time to do it. I'm so busy in my life, my job. Take the time to better yourself. Even if it's a couple hours at night, or an hour at night, half an hour at night. As you're winding down, take time to invest in yourself. That's what it's about. Education is investing in yourself. But at the same time, as you invest in yourself, you're investing in your community, your family, your dreams. So take the time. It's hard. Especially when you get doing things that you've never done before. Don't let people put you down. Take time to understand. There's YouTube out there. I don't like a lot of YouTube because I've ran across these YouTube videos that are not right. So make sure where you're getting your education from is a reliable source. Education is fundamental. It is the building blocks of life. Education, it's a natural occurring thing. Remember that. We're being educated the moment we are born. Now the key here is finding good educators, teachers, those that take time out of their life and they show you these things. I remember a little old woman called Anna. She was our neighbor when I was young, but Anna, bless her heart, took her time to educate the children of the neighborhood. And she educated us in life skills. This lady taught us how to make soap, how to can foods, how to maintain a garden, how to sew and quilt. Yes, I had to teach my wife how to crochet. So, there's things, if you're embarrassed about learning, well, that's going to bring burps in your life later. I know how to do dishes. I know how to clean. I know how to cook my own food. I know how to hunt. I know how to fish. I know how to prepare game and fish. See, education is key. There's things that we don't realize we've been educated about. And look at what you know, not what you don't know. And then once you're looking at what you know, you can start saying, hey, I want to add to this. I want to know how to do this. I want to know how to do that. And compile a good directory in your head of knowledge. 
education. It's a wonderful thing. And so many years I tried to avoid the classroom situation. So many years I wasted because I did not dive in, block the other people out. You are special and you can do whatever you need to do. Make it happen, people. Educate yourself today. It's a beautiful thing. Well, that does it for another episode of the Free Circle Fireside. Thanks for listening in. And make sure you come back next time, listen in to our next episode. You never know what we have to say right here on the fireside. Like always, share us out. Get involved. Tell your family, your friends. Most of all, get involved. Get over to our website, freecircle.website, and our new edition, podcast.freecircle.website that's where we house all of our media content from all of our podcasts make sure you go over check us out while you're there there's a survey there's a banner at the top of the website click on it it takes you to a survey for our audience the survey is provided by PodTrack it's a wonderful place to track your podcast it's analytics at its best get over to pod track check it out and please fill out our survey so we can know you our audience a little bit better and provide you with the content that you seek the most i'm ed with free circle and we're out